Hello catchy OS enthusiasts. Welcome back to another exciting update on one of the most performance focused Linux distributions. In today's video, we are diving into the first release of 2025 for catchy OS. Packed with optimizations, new features and important fixes. So let's get started. Delayed release and NVIDIA driver support. This release took a little longer than usual and for a good reason. The team wanted to ensure full support for the latest NVIDIA graphics cards before rolling it out. Now, with the inclusion of the new 570 NVIDIA driver, users with the Blackwell or 5000X series GPUs can enjoy full compatibility. However, it's worth noting that Blackwell only supports NVIDIA's open module driver, which required a change in how the ISOs handles NVIDIA modules. If you're using an older NVIDIA GPU, specifically the 1000X series or lower, you'll need to boot using the first option instead of the dedicated NVIDIA boot option. The installation process itself remains seamless thanks to CatchOS automatic hardware detection. Now, performance enhancements, propeller optimization. One of the biggest highlights in this update is the new optimization technique applied to the Catchy OS kernel. Previously, Auto FDO was enabled by default, but now with LLVM 19 available. The kernel is also optimized with propeller. When combined, these techniques can provide up to a 10% increase in throughput, along with the reduced latency. Through actual improvements will depend on your workload. If you are interested in how profiling is handled, check out the catchy OS benchmark script on GitHub. Contributions to improve workload coverage are always welcome. Now, user experience improvements. This update also brings a few long requested quality of life enhancements. For example, tap to click is now enabled by default 